minimum aeronautical experience required for an airplane instrument rating. 50 hours for a part 61, point 65. Um, 50 hours of cross country PIC time, of which 10 is in airplanes. 40 hours of actual, of which 15 is with a CFII, including one cross country flight of 250 nautical miles along airways or to be directed by ATC routing an instrument approach at each airport, three different kinds of approaches using navigation systems, and with a filed IFR flight plan. Also, at least three hours have to be in the last two calendar months prior to the practical test. Personal documents required for flight, pilot certificate, medical certificate, authorized photo ID, like a passport or driver's license, and outside of the US, restricted radio telephone operation operator license. The aircraft documents required for flight, aero, airworthiness certificate, A, airworthiness certificate, R, registration certificate, O, operation limitations, and W, weight and balance data from part 21.5, 91.103, 91.9, 91.203. Aircraft maintenance inspections required for IFR is AVIATE, A-V-I-A-T-E, A annual inspection every 12 calendar months, part 91.409, V VOR every 90 days, part 91.171, I means 100 hour inspection, 91.409, A altimeter, Altitude reporting and static system every 24 calendar months, 91.413. T transponder every 24 months, 91.413. And E ELT every 12 months, 91.207. Pre flight info required for IFR, 91.103. W craft. W weather reports and forecasts. K, known traffic delays as advised by ATC. R, runway length of intended use. A, alternatives available if flight cannot be completed as planned. F, fuel requirements. T, takeoff and landing performance data. Pre-flight self-assessment, I am safe. I, illness. M, medication. S, stress. A, alcohol. Eight hours bottled with throttle, no more than 0.04% of alcohol in your bloodstream. F, fatigue. E, emotion or eating. Risk management and personal minimums. PAVE, P-A-V-E. Pilot, general health, physical, mental, emotional state, proficiency and currency. A, aircraft, airworthiness, equipment and performance. V, environment weather hazards, terrain, airports, and runways to be used and other conditions, E, external pressures, meeting, people waiting at the destination, etc. As far as logging instrument time goes, a person may log instrument time only for that flight time when the person operates the aircraft solely by reference to instruments under actual or simulated instrument flight conditions. Instrument PIC recency of experience. The uh, an acronym is six hits, H-I-T-S. So the last six calendar months under actual or simulated instrument or flight training device simulator in the same aircraft category, you log six instrument approaches, holding procedures and tasks, intercept and track courses through the use of electronic navigation systems, or use an ATD, which is basically an approved PC flight simulator and hardware in the last two calendar months prior to the flight. It needs to be three hours of instrument experience, holding procedures and tasks, six instrument approaches, two unusual attitude recoveries in a descending VNE condition or two unusual attitude recoveries in an ascending stall speed condition. Uh, if you're not current, looking back six months, you can still log the requirements of six hits and get current with a safety pilot under simulated conditions. Um, so the safety pilot, instructor, or pilot examiner. 
Um, the safety pilot must be at least a private pilot with the appropriate category and class. He must have adequate vision forward and to each side of the aircraft. When using a safety pilot, the aircraft must have dual control systems. Looking back 12 calendar months, um, if the months are not current, you need an instrument proficiency check by a CFII examiner or approved person. And then certain IPC tasks found in the table at the end of the instrument PTS can be completed in an approved flight simulator or FTD. However, a full IPC cannot be, can only be conducted in certain full motion simulators or in the actual aircraft since some tasks such as circling maneuvers could not be completed on low end FTDs and simulators. Next, to carry passengers as PIC, three takeoff and landings in the last 90 days in the same category, class, and type, if the type rating is required. Um, at periods, it needs to be before one hour after sunset to one hour before sunrise. Three takeoffs and landings to a full stop um, during one hour after sunset to one hour before sunrise in the last 90 days. And to act as PIC, um, you have to have had the flight review in the last 24 calendar months. Um, and that will be part 6156, 91.109, and 61.57.